first first game as a Pirate Man is in the book, so uh, you'd obviously played a lot before. But what was it like, kind of experiencing that in the big house? Uh, I mean, it was electrifying. Honestly, I mean, these guys have opened me with welcome arms ever since I've been here. So um, just getting a chance to play with those guys for the first time was pretty exciting. How do you feel like it went? I mean, now you coming in with several new starters here around you, and tough, you know, tough place for that yeah. to start. Yeah. But how do you feel like it went up front? Um, I mean. I think it went good. That was our first true time playing as five. I, I mean, um, that was a s first start for two players, our left guard and our right guard. So um, I thought we did pretty well considering the fact that we've never played together. Right. So, How much do you feel like y'all can grow kind of from the film and just, you know, learning from the mistakes, that sort of stuff? This oh, week? there's plenty to get better at. I mean, we left a lot of stuff out there, um, but it takes all 11, so. Uh, the five up front, I think, will grow tremendously this week. Justin, pretty impressive, no sacks. Uh, I probably think that will not happen again against Michigan this year, so that's something to be proud of and something to build on. Yes, sir. Yep, I mean, like I said, having two guys with their first uh, career starts in college, I mean, that's very impressive. Coach Houston talked kind of about your leadership up front and – Kind of walk us through that because you have played a lot before, but coming into like a new locker room and kind of taking that leadership role. Um, like when I first got here, I just kind of kept my head down and work. I mean, uh, you kind of in, in a program like this, you have to like earn your respect. So um, when I finally earned that spot and uh, became more vocal, I I felt like being that we have some young guys. I mean, I've kind of been there, done it. So uh, kind of just bring those guys along with me. You've been in Daddy Ficklin Stadium before as a South Florida Bull. How excited are you to be in Daddy, Fli Daddy Ficklin this Saturday as an East Carolina Pirate? Uh, very excited. Um, I remember it was a Thursday night game, super, I mean, conditions were terrible. It was raining, and somehow this place was still electrifying. So I'm excited to see what good conditions and uh, Saturday football game will bring. Do you feel like you guys as a unit can grow after games, maybe more so than just kind of seeing the same things in practice? Like, you, you come away after that game thinking, like, oh, this will help us a bunch? Yo, 100%. I mean, um, you get great looks in practice. I mean, our scout team does the best that they can. But in all reality, when the things in game time are flying around ten times faster, I mean, people grow tremendously week by week. The familiarity with Coach Mogridge, I mean, I know we talked before that kind of played a role in getting right. here, but how much has that helped the, the transition? Um, it helped a lot. I mean, a lot of the verbiage is the same. I mean, plays are going to be different, but at the same time, they're all similar. Um, he's done a great job, even with these young guys, I mean, helping us all transition together to play as five, so it's been good. And then re, re Acclimating the center, have you enjoyed that? Because I know you played at some of USF, but that you know I know you played guard a lot too. Right. Um, honestly, I, I love being in the middle. I like the control of it. I like to. You, you kind of have a pace of the game. I mean, nothing can happen until you snap it. So I kind of like the ability to slow it down, get everybody on the same page, and let's go. And obviously, working too with two quarterbacks right now, you know, it could be a two quarterback system. <laughs> Are you trying to coach those guys up to or help them as much as possible? As yeah, well? I mean, all of us got to be on the same page because if we're not on the same page, one person doesn't do his job, it's not going to work. Um, and both Alex and Mason are both great quarterbacks. And every day out here is you compete. I mean, each day you earn your spot to play on Saturday. And I think Coach Kirkpatrick, he's going to put us in the right position to win. Does a lot of what they're learning, maybe by defenses and what they call, kind of go hand in hand with what you're looking at too? Oh, for sure. I mean, being a center, you look your eyes deep at safeties before the play even starts. I mean, your your checklist is the same as quarterback. Have you watched much Marshall yet? And if so, kind of what do you see from there at their defensive front? Yeah, we watch quite a bit of them. Um, they're a hard playing group, I feel like. Uh, their D line's really good. They're strong, they're fast, and their linebackers are really strong as well. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.